You know what Tom it is. Right then, so it's time to get a cutting disc. How dark is that? Shit. A uh, cutting disc. I used a. It wasn't even a cutting disc last time. It was like a, a grinding disc. So we need to get a cutting disc to cut the exhaust. So I'm going to go to my local. Well, I'm a local merchant and let's get it. Well, and I'm no specialist, but I'm thinking that is us, uh, this metal grinding disc to cut the exhaust. So let's go for it and pay for it. Uh, I've no idea how much it is, but. Oh. Right then guys, so this is the first time in the Meg. Uh, yeah, so just been to the builders merchants, picked up a cutting disc so we can actually cut the exhaust rather than grinding it. Um, so yeah, we shall get to my good friend Aaron's um, and then let's get some cutting in place. So hopefully it uh, gets sorted. Um, obviously I did want to do an exhaust, a driving video. Um, I'm going to have to wait until I get all the GoPro setup sorted because I haven't got like 700 quid to throw at a new setup and I don't see why I should when it, it's the GoPro mount's fault that it fell off. So yeah, we're going to do, just drive there and then uh, I'll catch up with you later. I'll do a little rev, a little exhaust rev just so you know what it sounds like and then uh, go from there. So yeah, I'll catch up with you guys in a bit. Peace. I've got to show you a, ch I've got to show you a cheeky little rev and that, and all before I start actually doing modifications. Um, so yeah, here we go. He's a little cheeky little rev. Man, it's oh my god, I love it. Do you know what? I ain't even gonna talk about driving it. I ain't even gonna talk about. It. I want to save it. I want to save it and actually use the actual the moment when i talk about how it makes me feel and all that kind of stuff and how different it is to the astra um so yeah no indication on an island yay what is the point in giving people indicators if they don't use them oh yes yes i was using indicator yep three two one go 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 What I love about it, it's got like an upshift, so when you crack the limiter a lot on the Astra, a standard, when you hit the limiter, it'll just be like Boop! on this, it'll like, it like, as like, I've heard one uh, with like an exhaust system, and it's like, it sounds like a DSG fart, it just goes <laughs> like that. Um, so yeah, let's go to my pals, get it all jacked up. The exhaust is gonna be boiling, so we're gonna have to wait for it to cool down. Uh, so yeah, let's get it on and uh, see you in a sec. Put it out, we can go. <laughs> you the maddest thing about it? When I need to stop. I've got the brakes for it, whereas on the Astra, nah, you ain't stopping. Right then, so 33 degrees, uh, the exhaust is absolutely roasting, so we're gonna have to literally cool down. Hopefully the sun uh, works its way over and gives us some shade. So what we're gonna do, uh, jack the car up, uh, handbrake, put it in first gear. We're gonna put four axle stands just so it's a nice level height. Um, and we've got some ultra sexy low jack. Um, and then we'll get started. I need to get one of these bad boys, look at that, big XL jack, I believe it's from Costco, so I might have to get myself on one of them, uh, big boy pump, it's not what you have at the tyre places, so yeah, jack it up, and then let's go. And this is why yeah, we use axle stands, because if this comes down on you like this, look how high that is game over so you might be alright in the in them again because of how high it is so uh yeah let's uh get the action stand on the axle points right and so there is a jacking point hopefully you can see that there um that is pretty sound that is and there is little lips there which i believe are for the axle stand same there and to jack don't even know where you jack on the rear 
could not see where it said. Um, Jesus. Well, I don't know. So um, I'm sure, sure it was. I think it's there. I think your jack there. And obviously, axe will stand there. So yeah, sweet. Let's uh, lower it down and uh, line up. Right then, so I've been in the shop, bought a drink because it's a nice hot day. Uh, I bought a cutting disc, I've even been to like B&Q, got a cutting disc. Uh, got to the spot, jacked it all up as you've just saw and uh, yep, it's already got a silence to delete so oh my, I'm being told by a friend I should just cut it and swap it anyway but I don't think there's any point just changing a pipe to another pipe but there really isn't. Uh, plus if I did that you've got to watch it because you're going to make it even shorter in it. It's going to make it even smaller. Um, so I think I think that's it. That's a massive, massive disappointment because it it's got a silence to delete and it still sounds like it, that is so quiet and it it's got little burbles and that and little pops but it's got nothing, man. Uh, so yeah, disappointed. Um, so that was a fail. The anti climax and it's just gone bump. Uh, so yeah, I'm just gonna have a look underneath it and just see if there's anything I can do. Just cut the cut the back box off. Can we do, can we cut the back box off? Should we cut the back box off? Well, if it happens, you'll see it in the next video, so we'll see. Some discussions have got to be had. Right then, so under the vehicle, uh, we've got, mate, why is it so dark, man? Right, right then, so, it's literally a straight pod, it's already been done. So it looks like a pretty meaty exhaust anyway, um, but that is where we are. Uh, the cat, I'm hope, mate. It, there's no way it can be decated, can it? No way, sounding like that. So I'm hoping there is still a little baby cat up there. Um, but yeah, so we're gonna have to decide what happens. I don't know. Right then. So where we are, where we are at. Um, it's already got centre section delete. Um, my brother and my friend are going, just do it, just do it. So I think we're going to cut the back box out. Um, I am in the process of sorting out a brand new exhaust system, so it might, might be full decat, uh, centre section, and maybe a little sporty back box. So what the hell, I've jacked the car up, it's in the air, the back box is looking at me like, please take me out, please take me out. So I think what we're going to do, we're just going to cut the back box out, for YOLO, um, I wanted a bit more sound anyway. It's still got the cat in, so we might get more rasps, pops and bangs and that. So uh, yeah, here's a free exhaust mod that any, pretty much anyone can do. Uh, and I've already looked at Halford, you can get like the joiners. So if I don't like it and it's too much or whatever, I'll just stick it back on, bang the sleeve back on, job done. So it is gonna be cut a bit shorter, just under like where the uh, cross member goes, where the wheel is um, for now. If I like it, then I'm just going to get an exhaust piece welded up so it actually comes out the back box, um, which that's the only downfall to it, that it's not actually going to come out the ex the back of the car right this moment in time. But I think for free pops, free bangs and better noise, uh, yeah, let's do it. So let's get on it. And so safety first, as you all know, we've got the glasses. <laughs> um, and uh, yeah, we're just gonna cut the uh, back box off. <laughs> you're right. You you were. Yeah, yeah, don't That's nice, isn't it? <laughs> um, yeah, we just got the angle grinder. We were cutting disc, and we're gonna. Uh, that that is a scary noise, you know. Especially on a new car, it's like. To be honest with you, I'm like 50-50. I want to do it. I don't want to do it. Some of you in the comments are gonna go, yo, you're wrecking your car. It's not, it's temporary, it can be changed. It's just literally like, yo, let's see what it sounds like. And it's free. So if I love it, sweet, just get a pipe done. If I don't like it, I'll just put the pipe back on and back to normal. So what I'm gonna do, just, I've been out in the car, so I'm just gonna give the exhaust some water just to uh, let it grow and now nah, just cool it down. Um, so yeah, let's do it. Yeah, yeah, but we might. Hmm. It's fucking. Let's take this off. It just spin. Yeah. I think the cutting this too long. You can set that guard off if you want. 
though for that's going to help much. Hang on. This is shit, this is. Right then, so what we're doing now is we're going to take them off the hanger. So there is a hanger. Um, I can't even see where the hanger is, but there is a hanger just behind that. And there's one off. Right then, so there is an axle. There is a mount here, which I've got to undo there. And one just literally there to remove it. So let's get it. Get it done. Yeah, it should be. Ready? Fuck me, that one there, they've gone into my head. Absolutely would have gone into my head. You get that on video? Yeah. Oh right. my god. Yeah. Be careful. See, see it behind. Get it spinning before you put it on the metal. Ah oh, man. I don't want to cut into the fucking... I feel like I'm going to get the shock. No, you don't want to touch it first. You want to spin it first and then contact. Yeah, yeah I know, but fuck you. Yeah, don't, don't put it in the where you've cut. You might have, hang on. If we... Have stopped. Uh, so just to try and get the hanger down a bit more, um, I'm just gonna do both of these nuts off just so it can kind of come down to me, so I've got more room to manoeuvre because um, it's tight. I should have got a bigger cut in this, but obviously I'm new to this shit, so I didn't know. But anyway, let's uh, drop this two there, and I think there's a couple, one or two there. Let's get it. Pretty much all the way in, man. It's fucking. Ready? Right. Stay away first. Spin and then do it. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> I, I've done this. You need to go for it. Just. Yeah. It's easy sitting there on the camera, isn't it? Going, oh, just do it, yeah. Wait. Do you want me to have a go? We've got problems now. It's gonna just hang like fuck, no? Because there's no hanger, so it's gonna do that. No, because you'll put the weight of the back box off. Once the weight of the back box is gone, mm. right, be right. What do you think? Come on, we're halfway. You're halfway there now, you've got no choice. <laughs> oh, no, I know that, but I can't even like, hang nothing to it or anchor it to it, can I? It's rough trying to drop this bit. You might be able to drop that bit in and snap it off. I don't understand why you ain't that tough on. You look like you bench press in the car. Yeah, man. <laughs> <laughs> An exhaust man manufactured just for the uh, so it's all nice and snug in place because at the minute it's just cut off just under where the wheels are, so obviously it's not the best place. But What's your thoughts on it? Uh, it's quieter if you're on boost, but when you get off it, it can be a bit droner. It can be a bit like, but it's not. Shifter noise, like to say, yo, shift up. 
um, which is pretty mega. Uh, I do like that. I do like that. I must say. Um, but other than that, I don't know. It's, I want it more poppy and bangy rather than the bang bang. Like, I don't know. Um, so yeah, that's that. Yes, guys. What is that? Then welcome back to. Well, it's not welcome back to another video. It's the same video that you've been currently watching, but. We had a problem, um, the microphone went absolutely tits up. Um, to be honest with you, I was fuming because uh, I come to, because I said obviously we're gonna do videos on a Sunday night and a Wednesday night. And what day is it today? It's Wednesday, so I don't like just closing off the video as if it's like, bang, that's it. Um, so I wanna like this, kind of like tell you what happened. Um, took the back box off. Um, I'm talking there like that. Blah, blah, blah and it's going because the microphones had it um new microphones been ordered so hopefully we get that in a couple of days but uh back box is off um don't get me wrong it sounds a lot louder it sounds a lot louder but it's just it's just really boomy and like whoop. um someone did say to me it'll sound like a tractor and it does but getting an exhaust soon anyway so YOLO um, but this was just to see what it was like um, I thought it would be a bit better it has got it does have a couple of pops and bangs are a lot deeper and bigger but it's a bit really boomy inside the cabin which is what I don't want um, so I'm not overall happy with it so see um, oh you could have indicated earlier you dick I'd uh, clear up shop, just explain to you what's going on. As I say, I like to keep you up to date, no bullshit. This is what it is, this is how it is. And that's hopefully why you watch the channel because I'm straight to the point and I try and go do this or don't do this or whatever. But um, personally, anyone can do it. Angle grinder, cut your back box off if you wanted to. But you might potentially ruin the sound of it. Some cars might sound better than others, but on this one, personally, I don't think it is. This is the thing that's crazy. On the Astra, you've got pre-cat, you've got another cat underneath, then you've got a silencer, then you've got a bat box. On this, you've just got a cat, a middle silencer, and a bat box, but it sounds so quiet. Like, I couldn't believe that the centre section's been deleted because it sounded so quiet. Um, so, that's why we just, it was jacked up with all forget it we'll go for it so uh, on that note i will see you on the next one hopefully sunday um so yeah like share subscribe do the bits we're nearly on 5k so go smash it peace